Number two, property-driven design. As your design progresses, manually created annotations on drawings become out of sync or outdated and just simply need updated. The solution is property-driven design. This allows you to create annotation based on object properties such as fields. And as you saw with text favorites, they can really increase your productivity. This provides the ability to place notes, labels, and leader text onto drawings, and they're kept up to date as the design progresses, resulting in a more reliable and consistent drawing. Property-driven design is really an encompassing of many technologies. It's tying our annotation to properties and other elements as well. It starts with annotation scale and works with things like text, text fields, text nodes, notes, cells, dimensions, tables, patterns, custom line styles, terrain contour labels, detailing symbols, sheet model boundaries, drawing models, reference files, item types, display rules, work set, and project-wise properties. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.